Good day, human Latiosites! This is Latiosazubril, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokémon Shuffle. So, let's begin! So, first of all, we do have some new main stages. Before we get to the Firo Coast, we have some new special stages, or not really. Um, we do have a string of, uh, well, we do have an escalation battle here, which, um, does give a lot of stuff. I just don't know if I'm gonna bother because time and Dale and main stages and all that fun stuff. Uh, we still have Tapu Koko. Um, we have uh, daily great challenges still here. So I mean, if you missed any in the past, they they should be coming up. You can find online which ones are um, well gonna be available. But we also have a new safari, which involves a bunch of, of Pikachus. The Angry Chew, the Winking Chew, the Enamored Chew, the Smiling Chew, and a Charizard costume Pikachu, which is the one that we need. So, they can drop some cool stuff, though, if you um, already have them, which I guess is kind of cool. I don't know what the drop rates are, but you can get experience booster, small, medium, and large. I don't know if I'm going to bother with the experience stuff, only because we are after the Charizard Chew. So let's do this! All right, we got 10 moves, and it is not the right Pikachu. That thing's smiling just too much. Almost, almost creepy, I must say. Almost creepy, not really creepy. Just, 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 that thing's a little too happy. Just a little too happy. All right. Take two. <laughs> All right, we got 10 moves to do this, so don't be the same Pikachu. Okay, this must be common. Because second heart, and we're finding the Charizard, too. All right, let's... Let's do this. We're not getting a burn, which is unfortunate. But we are going to get the Mega Evolution off, which is kind of nice. Almost a board wipe there. Um, not enough to get us the KO, though, which kind of sucks. I'm not going to lie. But barriers are not a problem when you have uh, Mega Heracross on your side. So... I don't know what it is with uh, with bugs like Beedrill and Heracross, but they Mega Evolve so darn fast that they're really good. <laughs> so, um... There we go. Eight moves remaining. We're gonna get a catch rate. Okay, base 17. Oh, it can't be that rare if... They, they can't be that common. It has to be rare if they gave it that kind of catch rate. 33%. That's one in three. Come on, stay in the ball. I bet you're going to break out just because. Just because. Just because I bet you're going to break out. You're not going to break out. Without, we're going to catch ourselves a Charizard costume Pikachu. All right, it has an attack power of 50, the electric typing, and the ability burn. With that, we have S rank capture the Charizard costume Pikachu. Nice! Alright, it only took us two hearts, which means we get to move on to the main stage. Congratulations, we caught all the Pokemon Safari. This is actually a pretty easy Safari, I must say, considering we already have four of the five. And this thing doesn't seem to be all that rare. I'm assuming my guess would be the Angry one would be the rare one, because that's probably the best one in the Safari. The only one I really invested in, to be honest. So, let's move on. Everything else is basically repeated, so we got Cricketot here. Alright. Um, hmm. Kind of weird that the music changes and we go in here. Although, it's probably because now we're on this. This is for the new area versus from the previous area, the music we were list we had before. You know what? Whatever. Whatever. We want our flying Pokemon. So, let's go Braviary and probably Lugia. And maybe Mints can come through for us. Hopefully we don't have too many uh, disruptions to deal with. If they're Brocks, I'm going to regret not bringing Fiero. If they're Blocks, then I'm going to regret not bringing... Do we have a Block Smasher? I think we might. I don't know. My memory sucks. That said, let's try to take this thing on. At the very least, might, might as well try to get an S rank. See what we can do. I'm going to add a plus 5, just to see what we can do. Alright, so we need to have 5 moves remaining in the end. Um, yeah, I probably should have brought Fiero in hindsight. 
Well, live and learn. Uh, let's do this. You know what? Let's get the Mega off. As soon as we can. Are you kidding me? Alright, well, you know what? As I was saying, let's get the Mega off as soon as we can in a Sky Blast combo. And we're gonna get immense to fall. So, this isn't too bad but so far, I don't think. Alright, so let's do this. No Sky Blast this time, which truly sucks. Yeah, because there we're gonna get that. Yeah, no Sky Blast. Not that I really expected at that time. Too many rocks. I really should have brought Fiero. Hindsight is 2020, though, as they say. Alright, let's do. I don't even know, to be honest. I mean, I can do this and hope for immense to fall, but I think the best bet is just straight up go for immense. The rocks will break. We're guaranteed to get a combo, at least, if nothing else. So it's not quite going to get us a victory, but I think we can at least get the S rank. We're not going to get a good catch rate. So we wouldn't have had an S rank otherwise. The plus 5 gave us the S rank. Now the question is, with three moves remaining, is it worth going for a Great Ball? My gut tells me no. Only so we don't have to spend a plus 5 again, unless we get a super catch power. So 22%. 1 in 5, my I, I don't like the odds, especially given we had luck with the Pikachu before. So 44%, no super catch power. The odds are against us. I'm going to take the S rank and run. I'm just going to take the S rank and run. No reason to, uh, to, to lose the S rank this time, because now I don't need to spend the plus 5 on it, and we can go after it again with the S rank. Next up is a bag on, so that's a repeated stage anyway. So... Hmm. Do I want to do Firo? Just to get those rocks, uh, well, get rid of those rocks there. I mean, Firo is not nearly as strong as Lugia because I didn't invest in it at all. But, the rock break might actually come in handy, though. So, let's do this. Alright. So we can do this just to break a bunch of those rocks. Really no way to get the Mega off uh, very uh, cleanly. So I'm just going to do this. Brings us closer to Mega Evolving, which means now I think we can get the Mega like this. but no Sky Blast. Alright, Fiero did come through there, which is kind of nice. We need Fiero to come through in order to actually be useful, because if it doesn't come through for us, then it, that's, it, all it is is a lower base power than, uh, well, attack power than Lugia, which is very much not good. So, Braviary is not coming through for us right now, which is definitely going to hurt us in the big picture. Oh boy. Alright, let's do this. I'm sure there was a better move somewhere, but... Um, I wasn't paying well enough attention, so there's that. I think we win. I'm pretty sure we win, so we did better, la we did better than last time. We still missed the S rank this time, so I don't regret my uh, keeping the S rank from before. But at least we don't have to spend 800 coins on the S rank since we already have that. That said, nice 52 combo there to finish this thing off. This is a nice, I guess, uh, big combo stage is if you have Fiero or something to get rid of those rocks. Once you get rid of the rocks, basically just your typical three Pokemon uh, uh, stage. So 27%, so not the worst catch rate in the world. Still not good. 
that better a better catch rate on the Pikachu. You're gonna break out straight away. I have nothing to lose by going for the 54% plus the super catch power up to 88%. I bet you this thing still breaks out with that 12%. Oh my god! I am so right about that. I was so right about that. I don't even know why I'm going for another great ball here. You're gonna break out of this one. Actually, you're not gonna break out of this one because that would be extremely unlikely considering you already broke out i wanted 12 percent but still you know i don't feel like going after you again so i'm going for that great ball so we're catching you has an attack power of 30 the bug typing and the ability daunt can delay your opponent's disruption for a turn and also increases damage with that we have captured cricketite so there we go cricketite leave me alone now all right you know what we might as well go and check in you know, get something for our efforts and whatnot. Uh, I did do the Mega Charizard X competition itemless, so I don't expect very much. We got a skill swap or two raise next levels and a level up, and a Mega Speed up. So for itemless, I'll take it. For an itemless attempt, I will take it. Alright, that said, Bagon is a dragon type, so... How shall we go about doing this? I kind of want to go all Heracross on it, even if it's not super effective. I kind of want to go all Heracross on this, because Heracross is pretty good. Although, watch it not be very good in this stage. Well, one way to find out. Okay. Eight moves, which means we basically have a little more than eight moves, to be honest, because that means... We can use up all eight moves plus one in order to get that uh, S rank. So, Heracross is not coming through for us right there, which is unfortunate. Can Zygarde come through? Zygarde's not... Nothing's coming through for us! How can we win if nothing comes through for us? I have no words. Curum is not coming through for- Nothing is coming through for us. I- I can't even- I cannot even explain it. Oh dear god. Okay, I don't think we have a chance at this point. I'm pretty sure that's pretty much GG at this point. We're not getting an S rank because it's just not happening. We would have needed stuff to come through for us, because that means we have two more moves. Bagon is a non-support. I didn't exactly expect that. I don't know why I didn't expect that, because I probably should have. So that is game! We are not getting an S rank this time, because... Because... I picked the wrong Mega Evolution. So we... Wait a minute! Did we just seriously... Did me and my infinite failure actually S-rank it? We did! Oh my god. Alright, there's the S-rank. This stage is actually not that difficult, I guess. If you picked the right Mega, which I did not. That said, next time we've got Cryogonal to take on here in Zafiro Coast. So, you know, I guess we can go, uh... I'm going to go take our time as we coast through this place, I think. I don't want to burn myself out or anything like that. But, you know, next time we're going to continue as we take on Cryogonal here in these new main stages. So, thank you for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time as we continue in these Pokemon Shuffle main stages after it seems they jumped the shark. Goodbye!